Laser scanning forum. I just found a topic where someone asked how to merge a drone data with a point cloud from laser scanner. As somebody answered already, the best way is to do a good survey work and place some target in a field so you will be able to use the same points for alignment point cloud from photogrammetry and point cloud from laser scanner. But also, it can be done with cloud compare it's a free software you can find it on internet and um, also I know that many of you it's already use it so you need to open a uh, boss point cloud uh, one from laser scanner and another from drone usually I use a e57 file format you can use another one but it doesn't matter Let's take a look. It's a data from laser scanner. It's good to switch to RGB color or to intensity. And also it's good tool to enable ideal lighting. It's allow you to see your point cloud more clear. How you can see, uh, there are da data scanned from the ground, but there are no points for roofs. And I have a points from roof scanned which photogrammetry uh, using drones and as you can see the drone data it's not aligned to the data from laser scanner to merge them together you need to select both point clouds and press align to point clouds button here you need to select which one point cloud will be moved accordingly to a reference Let's just select a point cloud from drone. After that, um, Cloud Compare proposes you to select the same points on both point clouds. And uh, it's good if you have reference targets, you can just click them. But I don't have it, so I will be just select a point cloud, a point that I guess is should be the same. There are not so many data overlap between scans, but I think that I can use these ridges to align everything. Let's just select these points on reference point cloud first. You just need to click on the points that you think is the same. Let's just go ahead with all ridges. I will be not pretty accurate, but uh, it's only for example purpose. And you probably need to check these points more accurately. After that, you can uh, turn off a reference point cloud and enable point cloud from drone. And you need to select the same points in the same order. I'm not sure that I'm really accurate. So it's done. You can see the errors here. It's something about age centimeters, the biggest one. And after that, uh, you need to press align button. And what will you see is that uh, all point cloud from drone is rotated accordingly. But also you can see that these points are not in the same position. It's because the da data from drone is uh, have a wrong scale. You can see that the roof. Uh, from drone is little wider than the data from a uh, laser scanner. It sometimes happens if you don't use any uh, control targets or scale bar in the field for photogrammetry and you use only a GPS coordinates from drone that is not very accurate and 
you, it can be the, the data from drone it's scaled wrongly so you need to check to, to adjust the scale of a point cloud data you need to check this checkbox adjust scale and press align again and you can see that uh, our point cloud from drone was scaled and now it's more or less fits the point left from a laser scanner. If you use targets, it should fit, uh, should, uh, fit perfectly, but I was not very accurate, but probably it's enough for uh, my purpose. So you need to press OK, you got some message which aligned info. And after that, you can save your point cloud, or also you can just merge it to a bigger one, to data from laser scanner directly in cloud compare to be sure that you save your uh, uh, scale and rotating uh, parameters. So you just need to select both point clouds and press merge button and you don't need to um, generate scalar field just merge everything together save and import whenever you want into recap or another software that's all have a good day and good luck with your project